Hey everyone, um, I'm coming at you guys really quick with a small um, little entry to my diary of a shopaholic, and it's just a really small haul, nothing too big, but um, I stopped by uh, Michael's when I went out of town for a doctor's appointment I had, um, just what, yesterday? Um, no, Friday, it was on Friday, so... Um, so I picked up just a few things and I thought I'd share them with you guys really fast. Um, so I'm going to just kind of get started. Um, I don't think I got anything too fancy, but um, I just thought I'd share it with you guys really quick before I put it all away. So um, the first thing I got were these. Um, I took them out of the box already and now I can't find the box. But they are these um, chalks and these are by Crayola. And I thought they were some really interesting... I have the flash on my camera right now, so maybe they might not show so true to color. But um, I thought they were very interesting colors. Um, I'm really interested in making some um, chalk mixes or some, you know, colored acrylics and stuff like that. So I um, picked those up. Because it just had a nice variety of colors, and they were really, they look very pigmented. So, I'm hoping that those will be nice to do something like that with. And I also picked up ugh, this big um, thing of 15 chalk sticks, and it's also by Crayola. And it has just some even different colors. If I could open it. So it has some more colors, and these are a little bit more chalky, but you never know if that's just the outer layer, and once you start grinding them down, they're probably a little bit brighter inside. So um, I just thought there were some different colors in here. They're absolutely not showing true to camera, I mean true to color on camera, but, um, oh, that's a little bit better. It just focuses a little. Okay, well, anyways, there's some really nice colors and some are a little bit more pink looking and a few different see these aren't showing true to color like this is a light pink it doesn't look all weird like that and this is a different tone of like mauvey purple it's really pretty so I just thought those were some more um, to mess around with and they're not just the basic colors you know that you can get like at the dollar store or something and this thing actually only cost like three bucks at Michael's so I thought that was um, a good deal so I picked up these and, um, In His Eyes, I'm Queen, um, if you guys watched our swap that we did, um, I think I posted it last week, um, she sent me a bunch of gorgeous chalk mixes already, and I'm not sure, but I think they had acrylic in them already. Anyways, with my, um, colored acrylics and stuff, I kind of wanted something to keep them all in the same place and keep them organized, so I picked up this container, and it's from Michaels it's that 25 piece um little containers and I think they are um gosh I want to say they're like 10 gram jars maybe 15 grams I don't know so uh, but I think that's enough for me you know I don't do too much acrylic work yet but um I definitely think her baggies will fill these jars up and this is the amount that I'll make to keep for myself of the ones I do make and the rest I'll probably just give away so that's what those are. Okay. Um, what else did I get? Um, um, well, while we're on containers, I picked up some more of these um, Recollections twist containers. Um, like I said before, I think I mentioned before that I use them for glitters that... Um, a friend of mine sends me and you know what I know I mentioned that a few times in my video that I have a friend that sends me stuff but um I don't always necessarily film the things that he sends me and he sends me some great things but the reason why I don't film it is I feel really awful not being able to tell you guys where he got them or how much it was and stuff like that you know and I and he's what he sends me is just like you know um 
amounts that they sell for like personal use and stuff so um, I don't know if you guys are at all interested in seeing more of the stuff that he sends me like him and his girlfriend um, let me know and I can make videos on you know the mail that I get from him but I just never know I just like I said I feel awful showing stuff where I can't tell you guys where to get it or things like that so um but if anyone really cares to see, like, some of the really cool stuff that he sends me, like, let me know and I will do it as long as you guys are okay with seeing it, knowing that I don't really have very much information on it. So, okay. Well, anyways, I got these containers. I got a couple of them for those things that he sends me. And I picked up some more baggies. I know I... You, there's baggies in, like, every one of my hauls. But, um... I don't know, I feel like there's something that I always need and I know that I'm always using. So these are the really, really small ones. And these are one and a half by one and a half inch. These are the two what are they? They are the two inch by one and a half. And then those are the one seven by one seven five. Yeah, one seven five by one seven five. So these are small. These are those nice squared ones that are like chubby, and these are like these, but just a tiny bit smaller, a little bit slimmer too, I think. So I got those three things of baggies. I just feel like I can never have enough of them. Um, I last time when I had showed you guys that I picked up the refills for my exact my new little exacto knife, the pink one, um, they weren't the right ones. So I picked up these, which are the same brand, and they're the pink little things. So um, I think these are the right ones. So I went ahead and picked those up. I picked up another one of these refills for my label maker. Um, and it's the clear transparent tape. That's my favorite one to use. Um, in the dollar section, I picked up this Hello Kitty, um, little notepad, sticky notepad. And what is, okay, the rest of it is just a few glitters that I didn't have in my collection. Um, or ones that I did that I picked up extras of. Um, I picked up this tulip glitter and it's the holographic one and this is, um, a fine glitter. And I also picked up a holographic, um, ultra fine glitter. So, I got those two because I didn't have these two by, by Tulip. I thought, um, I have a lot of silver holographics, so I never picked them up. But I just kept looking at them and knowing that I wanted them, so I grabbed them. Um, I got another one of these. Um, Jewel Apple Red, some iridescent squares, some crystal squares, and then I bought another one of the turquoise one that I always showed you guys, but, um, I'm just, I'm not showing everything because I picked up a bunch of stuff for, um, a giveaway that I'm hoping to do soon because I've reached 200 plus subscribers, so I'm really excited about that. So really quickly, the last few things, I picked up another one of these Martha Stewart blue um, blue raspberry glitters, and this one has become one of my favorite, and my other one's just like down to here. So um, I picked up another one of those since I used it so much. Um, these next recollection ones that I'm about to show you are ones that I didn't even know like existed because my Michaels didn't carry them, so... I never even knew to look for them. So when I saw these and they were different and ones I didn't have, I picked them up. So I picked up this one in um, ebony, but it's a fine glitter. It's not the ultra fine. So it's a little bit chunkier. I really liked that. I picked this one up in pumpkin. And I had never seen pumpkin or, or even like had heard anything about it. So pumpkin. I picked that one up. It's a really pretty orange. I picked this one up in cherry, but this is the fine glitter in cherry. I think, I couldn't remember if I had already owned the, the fine or the ultra fine. 
So I know one of these I didn't own. I don't know if it was a fine because it was chunkier or if I had the fine but didn't ever see the ultra fine. And I, I just, I really couldn't tell. So I went ahead and grabbed both of them. And I may or may not return whichever one, um, whichever one that I already own. If not, I'll just keep it. Like I said, I have a giveaway that I'm hoping to host coming up. So, um, either or, either or. So that's those two. And then I heard somebody say that they don't see this garnet one anymore. Um, and I had never seen it, actually. Let's see, focus. I had never seen garnet before. And, um, so I saw it, and it's a really pretty burgundy. And, um, like I said, I heard someone say that they couldn't find it anymore, and they thought that they weren't selling it anymore. So I just thought, well, I better pick one up. <laughs> it looks really pretty, and, um, it'd be nice to have it in my collection. So I picked that one up. That one's really pretty. And then last, I knew this one existed, but my Michaels never has it. So this is just sunflower, and it's a really pretty yellow. So I picked that one up. And I think that's everything, guys. Um, that's my little quick Michaels haul. So um, I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day. And I hope you guys continue to have a wonderful day. And I will talk to you all very, very soon. Okay, have a good one, guys.